Good morning folks. This morning I'm uh, checking out the pickling cucumber plant. If you remember this in another one I had two pickling cucumbers inside the greenhouse. I'm outside right now as you see. But I had these inside in the rail. But they were not very practical where they were at. Uh, a couple of reasons. One, they were being overshadowed and overgrown by the uh, squash and tomatoes. And two, these are a bush plant. Well, you can't see that here, but inside there were, it was a lot bushier and it was hard to get into the flowers to pollinate. And plus the flowers on the cucumbers are very small and they don't have the large parts that the uh, squash have. So it was very difficult to, to pollinate this one inside. So after I kind of tore them out, after a day or two I decided I'm going to try one of them in a DWC bucket outside. So that's what I did here. I built a DWC bucket. It's filled with nutrients. It needs to be topped off a bit. It's a little low right now, but the roots are down there. And then I have an air hose in there bubbling away. And outside it is done not too bad. I've pruned it off a lot. A lot of the dead leaves and all the dead cucumbers. I'm gonna have to trim these off. And as you can see, I have one, two, three and I guess that can be counted as four cucumbers going and got some flowers over here I'm hoping the bees will visit and get a few more off of here I'm gonna go ahead and harvest these two here they're a good size right now and pickling cucumbers can be eaten just like regular cucumbers so that's what I'm gonna try them I'm not into pickling yet maybe down the road we'll try a couple of these buckets and see if we can get a couple more but you can see this plant's still growing still has its little feeders going out and some green leaves although some leaves are having some bug problems so I'm gonna go ahead and snip these two off kind of tough there's one you can see let's get this other one here So we'll take those inside and cut them open and see how good they are, if any at all, for my first cucumbers. Let's go inside real quick and I'll show you the other cucumber plant. Inside the greenhouse, it's going pretty good. You see, it's more of a vine. And, uh, Therefore, it's a little bit easier right now to get in here and uh, pollinate. But the flowers, again, are not that big. Here's a male. And I stick my toothbrush in, or my paintbrush in there. There we go. Twist around. You never really see anything on the paintbrush. There we go. There we go. But I hope I got something. And then there's a the female. Again, not that big, and I'll just kind of brush in there. And hopefully I got some pollen on there. We'll know in a couple days. We're already pollinated that one back there, and that flower seems to be dying off, so maybe that indicates I got a good pollination in there. That's another male. And you notice that the males usually stay towards the base. I've got a lot of male flowers here towards the base, and then the females will be up and out on the vine. So, but it's growing pretty good for the vining one, and I'm hoping I'll be able to get in there. It's got a little more room to go up here. This one, I'm going to try to train over and put another one here. So hopefully in a week or two we'll have some slicing cucumbers as well. Well, I'm going to go inside and slice those up, so I'll see you inside in a minute, and we'll let you see the inside of a pickling cucumber. All right, here we are. I'm going to try to do this with one hand. I don't have a stand for my iPhone camera, but we're going to cut it open here. Nice and soft. Easy to cut. And there's the inside. It looks pretty good for our first hydroponic cucumber. Good. And smells good too. I, know I can't smell the camera, but it smells like a good fresh cucumber. 
I think I'm going to slice these up and put them into my morning smoothie. And let's see, taste test. Still alive and pretty moist and sweet. So I say that's a good cucumber. I say I'll probably slice up part of that and put it in my smoothie this morning and slice up the rest for a salad later. So I might keep on going with the pickling cucumbers as well outside of the greenhouse. That's it for now. Hydroponic cucumbers. One of the main reasons I started this. Cucumbers and spinach. So we'll talk to you later. Any comments please let me know.